Hello, I'm Rose King, Senior Pastor, Christian Outreach Center of Fort Worth, Texas. First of all, I want you to know how much God loves you. And I just want to minister to you a few minutes in the area of fear. There has been so much happening in our nation, in our cities, and the whole world the past year or so that would bring fear to you. But the Word of God says in 1 Timothy, 2 Timothy actually, the first chapter, 7th verse, that God did not give us the spirit of fear. No, fear is not from God. But he's given us power, love, and a sound mind. He doesn't want you timid. He doesn't want you afraid of anything or anyone. Fear is opposite faith. Fear is false evidence appearing real. So today, I want you to know that fear comes from the enemy, and you do not have to be afraid. Put your trust in Jesus. Make him the Lord of your life, and then your faith can become active. Faith, now faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. When you operate in faith, fear has to leave. So right now, I pray for you to take authority over fear of death, fear of lack, any fear that tries to attach itself to you. Father, in the name of Jesus, I pray for those that are watching me today who have been attacked in the area of fear. Father, let them know that your word is true. You've not given them the spirit of fear. You've given them power, love, and a sound mind, a well-balanced mind, a calm mind. They're not going crazy. Praise God, because they have the mind of Christ. And so, Lord, I ask you to touch those and to let them know that you love them and they have nothing to be afraid of. And we thank you for it in Jesus' name. If you not received Jesus into your heart, you need to do that according to Romans 10, 9 and 10. Just believe that he died and he rose again to justify you, to give you new life. And just say, Lord, I make you Lord of my life. I renounce my past. And now I come to you and I'm free from fear. I'm free from my past. I forgive and release everyone who's ever hurt me. I forgive myself and I receive your loving kindness and your tender mercy. Thank God I'm free from fear and I'm free to serve you. God bless you.